said it, the temperature is feeling hot. Today, no, it's not. I mean, you get out of the... It's rocking out of there. It's this guy who uh, ran. I mean, it looks the best kind of party ever. It's like, you're ready to damn fire party, put food on your tiny little tiny in your bag. Thanks for littering. Is we got your license corona? plate number. Really? Is that Corona? Maybe it just go across the street. I didn't see any I think that was the way. I don't even, if they got the lights around, it's like pulling up. Curb checking? <laughs> It's been about 90% of what we got. Seven, somebody's gonna be here. Yeah, Hold your sign up. Hold your sign up. Let's see it. Y'all get commodities? Right on, right on. It's probably a trumped up drug charge anyways. Or he got arrested for having a broken tail like Shadow. <laughs> Poor Leslie. We've had about 90% of things have actually been very pleasant. People have been very supportive. Always had the 10%, I guess. But it's uh, it's been pretty subtle. Perfect. But, you know, we have to, if that consensus thing, so yes. like, well, uh, I just wanted to tell Betty that okay. if, if you like the idea. That sounds great. But, I mean, she said that will attract people to be looking. And, That's but true. But if, if we have a meeting and everyone agrees, then we can all post about I'm it. I'm down. Okay. I'm down. Okay. Did you hear? No. Will you share? Yes. So.
Okay, what's your name and why are you out here? My name's Leslie Bentley and I'm out here because a lot of my friends that have graduated, they can't find jobs. Um, I know it's going to affect me, I'm going to graduate in the next few years. And also, I mean, people with degrees have to take jobs that usually wouldn't require it and that's stuff that I could work at. So technically, you know, I'm part of the trickle down effect. Or the lack of success of. Yeah, exactly. It's like I'm in the effect of the fact that people with degrees aren't getting the jobs that they need. So very good. That's, that's my story, and I'm sticking to it. All right. What's your name? Why are you here? Uh, my name is Mike. I'm here to stand and be counted for the basic human principle of equality. I'm here specifically to spread love and happiness 
and Can you name one more time because I think we got lost in the car honking. Mike Davis. Mike Davis, very good. What's your name and why are you here? Hi, I'm Kyle. I'm out here supporting the 99%, those of us who don't have a voice in Washington, those of us who can't be here today, those of us who have jobs and have to support their families and can't be here to protest. I'm part of the underemployed and overeducated. I'm here to hopefully raise awareness and get this whole movement started. Change, change, change. Very good. Okay, what's your name? Why are you here? I'm Kimberly France. I'm here to show support for everyone in New York occupying Wall Street and everyone all over the world occupying, you know, their cities, towns, whatever. You know, just corporate greed, political corruption, it's gone too far and it's time we, you know, stand up and, you know, let them know it's enough. Very good. Thank you. What's your name and why are you here? My name's Tyler. I'm here because I'm one of the 99% and so are you. So why are you here? What's your name and why are you here? I'm Sophie and I'm here because I'm an English major and I'm, my professor told me welcome to the major, would you like fries with that? I need to know how I'm going to pay for 30000 plus in student loans when I get out of here. Very good, thank you. What's your name and why are you here? Hi, I'm Heather and I am here protesting the fiscal irresponsibility um, and policy decades, or three decades, um, 30 years. Uh, you know, I think that fiscal responsibility includes making sure that our regulations um, reward long-term thinking and they disincentivize short-term scams like derivative markets and commodity and um, speculations as well as currency kind of just, you know, fluctuations as if that's producing or making or, or in any way actually growing um, a real economy. I also think that um, the fiscal criminals need to be prosecuted. There needs to be special prosecutors um, since the regular kind of methods of prosecution have not been as thoroughly prioritized. So I think that those criminals need to be investigated and prosecuted. Um, and also I think that quite frankly, you know, millionaires and billionaires need to fair, pay their fair share. And that means not just on income, but on dividends and on capital gains. So those are the three things that I'm concerned with. However, apparently one guy just thought that liberals suck. But, you know, that's not really an argument. Little does he know there are libertarians out here as well. Right, probably. Thank you. Thank you. Hello? What's your name and why are you oh. here? Hello, my name is Felicia Levinson, and I'm here to represent the common woman. I have my sign here that says about the living wage. If you're a single mother that has a child and you're not getting paid this, you're, su you're suffering. So I'm here to represent those mothers and those babies that need this, these wages here. That's there. why I'm here. All right. Okay, go ahead. And uh, I just found out within the past previous year that I got M MS, multiple sclerosis, and uh, my medication is like supposed to be $3,000 a month to help me live longer. I'm only making 900 a month, 500 of which is going, about 500 is going to rent and electric, and the other four or five. And the other four or five is leaves me with groceries. It's just not, you live for about two weeks and then the rest of them up. And, so how am I supposed to pay for medicine? It's just not real. And we haven't gotten a raise on disability for the last three years, I think. Yeah. It's just silly. And they're giving it all to the fat cats. Because I guess the more rich people get, the more they want to grab. And your name one more time? Bart Wasilkowski. Very good. Because greed is an addiction. Yes, it is. It's Thank like, you. It's like crack.
it might take like eight. Yeah. No. So what convinced them to finally like give it back? She said that. What's your name and why are you here? Hey, I'm Robert Wilhelm. Um, I'm here because I have four nieces and a little brother, and I'm tired of paying for my for present with their future. Yeah. Very good. What's your name and why are you here? I'm Joan. I'm standing up for the, the needs of people over the needs of corporations. I'm hoping this is going to be the American autumn to follow up the Arab Spring. Very good. We are the 99%. We are the 99%. We are the 99%. Strike by the We're like six year olds. Who does it? That is awesome. Sorry, I feel like a girl. No offense. I'm offended.